Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discuss about how to set up robot framework for REST APIs. Okay, here before like before going to this setup and all, please go through that my previous videos, how to install and all. And based upon that, you can come for this video for Python, PyCharm after installation and after installation for robot framework. Then you can come to in this video. Then you can able to understand how we can able to set up for our robotic framework project. Okay. Here first we need to open for PyCharm. In this PyCharm we need to go for new new project. This is a couple of steps we need to require create new project. And then you need to write for robot framework with API. Okay, and you need to choose for new environment using virtual, and then you can able to use for the same path 38 version of Python. This is a one. Okay then you need to click for create and it will ask you for this window or new window in your case you can use for this window and in my case i'm going to use for new window once we created then we need to go for this location settings project under python interpreter the symbol we need to click and we need to add for REST API add a libraries right in the first session which we added environment setup time we are installed for some few things that is robot framework request and robot framework i underscore request and json libraries these are the four we installed right these four libraries we need to add into here that how we can able to add means click for file select settings and project expand and python interpreter then now you are able to see for some few things only correct now we need to add for our files click plus symbol and search for robot framework now robot framework and robot framework is presented here and you can able to see that description and all and you can able to see that version of that robot framework and you can able to tick mark and you can able to select which version you want to install okay by default it will show something okay which version it is present that if you want you can able to use it i so you can able to tick mark and you can able to specify which version you want to install it by default it will show latest version only i'm using latest version and installing that packages click for install package once it is completed it will show for green What is taking time? Now it is showing for installed successful. Then we need to install for request and request is presented here. Again, we can able to click for install packages. And then again, it will download and it will take for time. And but it will download for all related information. Now updated successful. Then next one is 
robot framework iPhone request and you can able to see here and you can able to install don't install for all we will go for one by one and then the later video session we will check for request extensions and request checkers and request loggers how what are the things we can able to install and how why it is required we will see in the later video sessions now present what are the things we require for those things only we will install and see whether we can able to do it or not like that now everything if it is installed and it is showing the green then we will go for next step and we need to create for directory and the file and we need to create for one robot file go file okay and now i am going to creating here everything is success then i am closing and again i will okay then everything is installed package is now ready now again you can able to see here there is a binary and it is adding for all things into our robotic framework and everything into this project now and leave folders and it is adding so many things now and external files also you can able to extract for this python 3.8 related information external things and leaf folder related information everything it is presented here now everything is installed then we need to create one directory first here new directory and the year is test case this case is my directory and again we need to create for one file and file is tc1 underscore demo dot extension is robot and click enter once we enter and it will inside that it will present for our robotic framework okay now it will see now it is presented here once we enter into here we can able to copy paste for this required information and we can able to check it whether it is working as expected or not and copying this one and pasting here okay, now it is presented in case if you are not seeing this this type of colors and it will by default it will show there is a plugin it is not presented for robot framework just add the plugin then you can able to see this color type in case if you are not seeing the color also not on okay no problem you can able to execute and check whether it is working as expected or not okay this is a simple example what exactly it is presented and all we'll see in the later video session where this video is basically whether it is expected working or not and later video session we'll see for how we can able to do it this all the things and why create session and this all the things we'll see open terminal in the terminal we are going to use for robot space and directory that is this test case slash and we are going to first tc1 underscore demo dot robot okay this is my class just enter you can able to see pass yeah now pass my robot framework is setup is completed into my pycharm now everything is working what are the things this all the things and why we are checking here on the we'll discuss into our first class okay coming to next session okay that's all about this video i hope you enjoyed if you like this video please like my video please subscribe my youtube channel 
Don't forget to share your friends and colleagues. Thank you.